Right, here we go. I think we're going to do it to Markle's house now because I think Trevor knows where he is. Let's go over there. Bit Trevor with that ball there, do you know? Give him a nice clean shave. There you are, you little shit. Are you looking for this? Dude, very funny. You know, you're a real asshole. What did you just fucking say to me? Stop it! You two, you're ruining my fucking yoga! Somebody say yoga? Ever? Mike. Hey. Good to see you, man. Mm. Yeah, I bet it is. Of course. This one. Again, a bit of an awkward situation. Come on, me, bro. One of those take your own bets to your best friend. You know, run off your phone. Big match. It's Trevor who's driving Michael's car. <laughs> you know, I could probably handle this myself. Let's say we grab a beer in a few hours, catch up properly. I'm good, homie. She's my daughter. I'll handle it. Judging by past behavior and the state of the rest of your family, fuck only knows what that means. Hey, fuck you. Yeah, you're a model husband and a wonderful parent. You can just tell. You walk into my home and try to tell me how to run my life. It don't work like that, amigo. It's nice to see you and all, but you stink like piss, you got blood under your nails, and you look like you've been up for what, a week? Who the fuck are you to tell me anything? I'm someone who knows you, you fucking slippery snake. I know the second I leave you, you'll just go home. We're gonna get your girl from these assholes. You're not abandoning Oh, shit. Jesus. You're not abandoning her like you did me and Brad. Yeah, Brad. Poor mother. Fucker must have woke up handcuffed to a hospital gurney after that stunt of yours. He still writes to me from the joint, you know. Really? Yeah. Okay. So, how you been doing? Oh, I'm getting by. Aside from the loneliness and heartbreak, of course. You live in Los Santos? A few hours away. Okay. To where? Sandy Shores. The Alamo Sea. Ah, here it's nice there. Yeah, it's fucking beautiful. I mean, we ain't got the tennis courts, the golf links, all the pumped-up plastic sluts you're used to out here, but, well, you know, it'll do. 
Yeah, well, you know, I'd ask you to stay, but... Yeah, don't worry, all right? I got somewhere to crash while we work things out. With actual friends. We got things to work out. <laughs> yes, sirree. Okay, this will be it. Maze Bank Arena. Let's find them. It's showtime, kids. These spaces are reserved for production vehicles. No one cares. Come on, you dipshit. Ah, that host, man, he's like any closeted TV presenter. Bitter as fucking vinegar. Where the fuck are they? Hello, sir. May I please have your name? Where the fuck is Tracy Townley, huh? Tracy fucking DeSanta. Fuck, screw this! Where the fuck's Laszlo? <laughs> All right. Yeah. That was really... All right. It's the auditions, Fame or Shame, Season 14, right here in Vinewood, San Andreas. Coming up next, it's Tracy DeSanta. Judges, Tracy DeSanta. Yes. Oh, hi. All right. Tracy's a dancer, but she also likes acting, modeling, and working with children. That's, that's beautiful. You're so original, like a, oh. a basket full of puppies or a <laughs> rainbow or a pile of puke. Oh. Who are these clowns? That's my dad and Trevor? Two dads. Oh. <laughs> Great. Wow. Very San Andreas. What are you guys doing here? Yeah, what are you uh, doing here? Okay, I'm at. Relax, chill, make yourself at home. We've got a little show to do here. Three, two, one. All right, it's fame or shame for Tracy DeSanta. Music. No, it's going to get copyrighted. Try to talk over this as much as we can. <coughs> Don't want this copyright. Get off this cliff. Get the claim on. Judge is a little mortified. Rip on version of uh, Britain's Got Talent. Tracy! Hey, you little prick! Come on, you gotta hurry up. Ah, they told us. We gotta take the truck. There! We take the truck! Yeah, it was packed. I got a deposit on that truck! Nope, not anymore. Hey, take a left up here. How can you sit there and watch your daughter get treated like that? Hey, you raise a daughter in this town, you get used to stunts. It's poor parenting. Now, thanks for the fucking feedback. It means a lot coming from you. No one's getting in the way of the big rig. We'll flatten this dick. <laughs> fucking Laszlo. I knew he was an asshole. Just push him off the fucking road! It's Catch only it a battery car, come on. come on! This ain't exactly a racer. Move out the way. Look, he went left. Look at him! He's on the train tracks! We can have a little fun with him. But let's not try to kill this prick, alright? When we crush his little toy car, who knows what'll happen to him? We gotta go to the left! I knew this city would be full of douchebags! Move out the way. Can we speed it up a little? Huh? Maybe by throwing your fat carcass over the side. Look, you went right. He's gone round to the right. 
Can't get enough of the celebrities, can you? Ten fucking minutes in LS. Shut up! That cocksucker might be famous, but oh. Oof. We'll get him. We'll get him. I believe Lasso has been in every GTA game as well. Chill the fuck out. Ha ha! He's going down into the LS River. I can see that. Yeet. I hate that closeted man whore on the TV. I hate him on the radio. I hate him even more in person. He was never funny. Little shit. A lot of juice. Dirty. The little shit's all out of juice. <laughs> Hey, 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 guys, you run out of batteries, huh? I didn't mean anything by it, all right? Oh, yeah? Well, that little girl sat on my lap when she was two years old, and I swore to God that I would whip the fucking skin off anyone who fucking wronged her. Look, I'm just a dumb A-list celebrity trying to entertain America, okay? I got a lot of stuff going on right now, dude, besides you trying to kill me. Now I got multiple sexual harassment lawsuits, plus I'm an addict, all right? And I've relapsed. I can't stop jacking, dude. I jack it in traffic. What's your attention? Uh huh? I mean, aside from loving stuff. Dude, haven't you seen my show? It's not live, it's not funny. That's my genius, I got no fucking talent. You clearly ain't being humble, T. Yeah. You proved your point. Yeah. This is your daughter. You should be wanting to rip the fucking ponytail off the back of this guy's head. And you! Huh? Hey. Uh. Uh. Okay. There you go. Uh. All right. What are you doing now? I want you to dance sexy, celebrity. Uh -huh. I mean, I need music, or... Are you trying to fucking annoy me, huh? I'll dance. Good. <laughs> all right, all right, now drop it like it's hot, all right? I want to see you get nice and low. Come on, lower, oh, lower, come oh, on. No. Please don't kill me, okay? I'm supposed to be on a magazine cover next week. All right, all right. Please, come on, no. get up. No. Take off. Go, now, before I change my mind. I got it all on my camera, you fucking pussy. The world's gonna see your shit. <laughs> I'm going home. How the fuck did you do it without me for nine years, huh? <laughs> oh, Dave, we need to talk. I was about to tell you the same thing. Okay, meet me at Galileo Observatory as soon as you can get there. Okay. Fame or shame? 88%. Oh, fastest speed 90%. Oh, we we're so close to getting that gold. I think. Oh, yeah, we can call taxis. Yeah, we're going to get a taxi to the next mission. Hello. Yeah, can you send out a cab to me? Stay where you are. I got a driver right around the corner. Okay, thanks for your help. So, you do have a driver right around the corner then? I don't see a taxi yet. Oh, here we go. Never mind. Where you headed, homie? Hey, Lester. Mike. Hey, uh, I'm transferring your cut of the jewel store take to your account. Madrazo's already got the house money, so you can rest easy there. Ah, thank God for that. Uh, uh. Galileo Observatory. I'll get you there fast, buddy. Come on, get the lead out. So then we can just fast travel over there. Perfect. Sorry, man. This is the limit. Excuse like, me interested for in financing, but I had to say uh, late because my dad, right, is like a big time investor. Oh, it's down here, isn't it? Davy, how you doing? About as good as can be expected, but the news is not good. 
I don't know what you're talking about. I know you did that fucking jewelry job. Dave, seriously, you're imagining things. Fuck you. All right. I did it. Arrest me. You know what? You'll be saving my life. Because you called it, motherfucker. What? You called it. Trevor. A couple days ago. But we haven't really talked about anything either. But if no when, he starts asking questions about why you're not feeding worms south of the Canadian border. Oh, we got problems. Yeah, no shit. You're in it. Yeah. So, if your problems are my problems, then I guess that means that my problems are sort of your problems. Uh-uh. Nope. What if I lose my job? Someone comes into my office, starts reading my files. They'll see the things I did. I know a lot of stuff. I can cop a plea, get five years, but you... Fuck you. You are me for prick. I made your career. Yeah. Well, we better go about saving it together, because... You and I both know we can't let go of shit now. What do you need? This guy. Ferdinand Karamov. The agency claims he's dead. We at the Bureau think they're full of crap. We think he's being debriefed someplace. So? Apparently, he has information that could put me and my superiors out of circulation. Those agency fuckers have got the coroner's office locked down. We need you to verify the body. How the hell am I gonna get in here? Well, you played dead before, haven't you? Ready. Oh, he's an advert for clean living. Note the discoloration of the teeth and the fingers. Smoker. Back a day, I. There we go, got you. Back from the dead, motherfucker. <laughs> Come on, hands in the air. Might be in the other room. You went to yourself. Come. Cheers for the gun. Yeah, drum.
That's right. Oh, you fucker. For you gone. Need to take the stairs. Containment, containment, containment. I should have stayed on the slab. You fuck. Come on, come on, keep going, keep going. Damn right, you've got a bleeder. And so are you. Your business. Get your weapon. This is for the greater good. Asshole. Come on. Peek your head around there. Just let me go. Let me go. Don't need to sing Gary Barlow there. Straight into the trash. Come on. I'm confident I need to get out of here. Get out of here. Right, cut away, cut away. Can we break this? Yes. Break it, break it, break it, break it. No, it breaks, but it's stuck. Go, 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 go through it, go through it. Just hide here, hide in here. We might not get seen with a bear look. Let's just chill here for a bit. Oh, now we've been seen. Tilt the car, tilt the car. I'll throw it Does this fence break? Yes, it does. We might do actually go over here. on my car like this, there, but no, 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 they could see me, they could see, they could see me actually, grab it there, just chilling right here, Let's reverse it slightly out, so we'd, yes, we lost him, hey Mike, F, hey we need to talk, quick, meet me at those oil derricks just outside town, El Burro Heights, and make sure you're not tailed. Man, that don't sound too good, homie. Look, I'm on my way. Dave, the hell was that? You know how many spooks I just ran into? I'm sorry. They're not nice people if that's a consolation. What's going on? There's a big target out there. Something in the shadows. 
The data algorithms are reading off the charts. Whoever finds it, the Bureau or the agency, is gonna get a big bump in funding. Like I care about your funding. I'm out, Dave. You're not. I need you to meet my boss. We'll be downtown in the plaza between the FIB and the IAA buildings. The IAA building? You fucking kidding me after the spat I just had with those agency men? Relax. They won't be looking there. They never expected oh, a shit. job. Hey, Franklin. What's going on? You gotta get out of town. Man, I ain't exactly got nowhere to go. Well, then take a trip. A long trip. What the fuck is going on? Things, all right? You remember, I told you I know people. Feds who looked after me when I retired. You did? Yeah, I did. I mean, I think I did. I don't know. Shit, Jesus Christ, Franklin. I got so many stories, I can't even keep them straight. I'm full of shit. Yeah, but your full of shit got me a lot of paper. One score with you, I made more money than I ever did hustling. Yeah, I mean, I'm a great thief. You know, it's the other shit that I ain't got figured out. So what's the deal, man? What's the deal with the bureau, man? This clown. I mean, he's an okay guy. Fucking cocksucker. We did a deal a long time ago. Didn't go quite the way it was supposed to go. Wrong guy got killed. So I had to go into kind of a, an informal witness protection program. He helped me. I didn't reveal secrets of his. Everything was cool. Problem started when recently I became unretired. I mean, he shows up, starts calling in favors, telling me to do shit. I mean, look, Franklin, I'm working for the fucking feds. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, fuck, man. Yeah, and that ain't even the worst part. <sighs> Did I ever tell you about Trevor? Hmm? Man, I, I think so. Shit. Well, if you only think so, then I wasn't being completely honest. He's, I don't, hell walking on Earth. That's what he is. Well, let's bury this motherfucker. Oh, yeah, good luck with that. Shit. Well, Trevor and I got history. Complicated fucking history. Look, I've done a lot of things that I ain't proud of. And I never claimed to be an angel. But you meet Trevor Franklin. You'll swear I am an angel. So what's the mood in man? I don't know. I'm just gonna, you know, try to play both sides. You know, try to find a way out of this shit. Oh man, look, man, you help me. The way I see it, man, the least I can do is help you. So that shit is right. Man, I, I, I ain't trying to hear all that shit, man. If the Bureau ain't gonna take you to court, them motherfuckers just hustlers anyway. And I ain't finna let no motherfucking cat think he's so motherfucking crazy run me up a tree. Fuck that. This means a lot to me. I told you, I'm a terrific thief. Find something for you. Big. Come on. You get to the top. Oh, man. I'm with you. I'm with you. Oh, really? We're a bronze on that one. Oh, well. We're strapped. Uh, we're not really striving for gold, but like it's just an added bonus if we had gold on the side. Uh, yeah, so I'll catch you next time.